So hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In the previous video, we were so in the previous video we have learned about what information gathering is. So basically, there are particular different ways using which you can gather information gathering. We have discussed all of this information in the previous video. There will be link in the description. You can definitely watch the video. So yeah. In this video, we will learn about different techniques of obtaining IP address, physical address, and using different tools, including WHOIS. So yeah. So in this case, you can use any website you want. In my case, I'm using Google.com. So if I want to check whether a website is responding to my data packets or not, I would type ping Google.com. So what it does is it sends packets to the website and uh, receives it and tells us how much time it has taken uh, for this thing so if you want to cancel it you can always type control c so here you can see it has uh, shown it is showing us that uh, around 20 packets has been transmitted 20 has been received and there has been zero percent packet loss so if we go above or on the top, here you can see it is saying ping google.com and it is also showing us some IP address. Here you can see in my case, it is 216.58.196.110. So yeah, if uh, again, you want to know about the IP address of another website, for, ex uh, for example, if you want to use a different tool. So let me tell you one thing that uh, this ping tool comes pre-installed in many operating systems including windows linux and mac os yeah so yeah if i want to check the ip address of this website again or using different tool there is one such tool available and that is nslookup nslookup google.com so here you can see it is showing us some information so here in this case this is my routers information my routers details and this here you can see it is 216.58.196.110 this is the address of ip address of google.com website so if we go on top here you can see it is the same so yeah this is it and if you want to know about some more websites and if you want to know using internet so here you can see i have opened up google you can use whichever search engine you want whichever browser you want it's a personal preference uh, so i have type as in my case i don't know about any website which could give me information so i would type what is an ip address of a website of a website so yeah here it is what is an ip address from website find ip address of website here you can see there is double word <laughs> so sorry for that uh, so here you can see there is one such website called ip checker i have opened it in a separate tab so if i type google and I type it's asking for a captcha yeah I'm definitely not a robot so here you can see it is showing us different information so here you can see it is showing us a different IP address because it's so it depends on the server you have been connected to so in uh, my case it is showing US California yeah and it is also showing geolocation IP address, domain name, and a bunch of different information. So here you can see it is showing uploading date, creation date, 1997, and a ton of other information is also available. Here you can read it if you want. So yeah. Now we would be using another tool, who is? This is one such tool available in the Kali Linux machine. 
or you could also install it by typing sudo apt install oh, yes. it will ask for your password so yeah zero upgrade is because mine has already the software installed so yeah i don't need any another i know right so i don't need to install the software again as it is already installed so if in my case i want to search for who is google.com and hit enter so it is searching for it and let me maximize it so here you can see it is showing us a bunch of information here you can see the same information which is available on this website it is showing us using this tool here you can see domain name register domain name id register who is server register url uploaded creation date register and there are a ton of information available so what is the purpose of this video is you want to search the information which the which your client or which uh, the owner of the website or any other thing don't wants to get revealed so you know, for example there is a confidential information which is available on the internet which is bad for the company or which is bad for the red reputation you know you know it right so yeah they don't want it to be out so that's the reason of this information gathering and what you need to do is you need to note down this information and make a report about how we find it and a bunch of other stuff we will talk about it later in this series yeah so yeah this is all about this video if you like it so if you like the video press the like button subscribe it you can share it with your friends so yeah meet you in the next one peace